Hello there, welcome into the channel. This is Sage, Sunset Healing Tarot. Thank you so much for being here and I do hope you are doing well in this time. Thank you so much for liking the video, for sharing it with those you love and for being a subscriber here. Thank you so much even for your beautiful comments. Really appreciate it. Do continue to support the channel. Your support is abundantly appreciated, right? General card messages for you for today. So all of the messages may not apply to all of you. So take the ones that do apply and the rest let them fly, okay? So breathe in here with me. Welcome your energy in and I hope to get some accurate messages out for you. Okay, we have the first card. The Ace of Pentacles and I hear rich, I don't know. Pentacles is money energy, but then I hear rich, real rich, in a male voice, a song. What is that? Something is coming around to you today. Prosperity. What is that? Something that you're working on. But it feels like something new, like someone may pull up something new. Someone dressed in all white. Someone wealthy, maybe. What are they coming around to you for? I don't know if they're exactly coming to you, but but it's just like this new feeling will come through your life. It's like the, this person is driving a white car and they're dressed in all white. And they may be new to the town and they're bringing something for you. Like, um, like a new energy, like new opportunities or something like that for today. The jack of hearts oh my god see what i mean it could be love coming around to you today maybe bringing in money to you jack of hearts could be a message that you're receiving maybe a past person wants to come through like i say someone visit driving a white car in all white this jack of hearts maybe cancer pisces or scorpio oh my god the next card is the ace of hearts so, and this is, I say, this person is coming around because they love you so much. All right. This could be me giving you this message because I do love you a lot. And it could be something valuable that you're receiving. Oh my God. So pretty. I don't know. But look, it just looks so wonderful, isn't it? I like that. Mm-hmm. All right, so let's continue. So the Ace of Hearts is abundance of love and overflow of love, new love. Like I said, something new coming in. I said someone wearing white and driving a white car. So Ace of Hearts, Ace of Pentacles. So it just feels like something matching, like outstanding, outstandingly new. You know what I mean? Like this person wears all white, driving a white car and driving through your city. And it's not like it's gonna change your life for some reason. You know, this you may meet this person. You know what I mean? So let's look. The ten. I just shuffled these, you know, so I'm just seeing these cards for the first time. So just they 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 want <laughs> they want a happy family with you, or uh, this is their dream come true, or they see you as their dream come true. But this is like spontaneous. I don't know how it's how else to say that. Um, they may be coming around in your family house, or this this is an old love, or not old. Like this is new. I don't know how to say it. I'm looking at my coffee cups and I'm seeing red hearts all over the cup. You know, like there's a lot of love energy. I'm seeing purple flowers in my room. Beautiful. Uh, so the Ten of Cups for me is my dream come true card. This person maybe wants to make your dream come true. They may be coming with flowers for you. Like look at this. The Ace of Cups, the Jack of Hearts. Oh, wrong direction. Maybe this person will go the wrong direction. Like I'm saying, I feel like they are new. Because oh, you can see, they're, it's like they're coming with this a bunch of roses. Oh my goodness. All right, so let's continue. So we're going to look at 
the highest point of this day. <laughs> what the fudge? The queen of cub. You know what I mean? I feel like you're gonna be so bloomingly happy. And we're talking about roses. Maybe you are receiving these roses. Like someone sending you flowers. Oh my. That's very nice. Like look at this. This is the queen of cups. So you're at the top here. This is what. Oh you do have a flower in your hand. You know see them. Whether you're male or female. Like some. If you're a male. If you're a male. It's this. It's this such a nice side of you. It's side of you that you don't talk a lot. Like the mysterious side of you that someone is drawn to. Something even about your eyes. And your smile. And your centeredness. You know what I mean? If you're a male. And this person may want to just gift you with, with something. Flowers. You know, this person wants to make you smile. So the highlight of the day is the Queen of Cups. I'm, 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 so that's emotional. That's expressive. That's being radiant and beautiful. And flowing. Like I'm looking at your hair. It's flowing. Um... Oh, no, I just at the bottom of the deck we have the seven uh, here at crossroads with the seven of the seven of swords feels like a crossroads crossroads seven of swords why is that doing that to me it's, what is it wanting me to do here it wants me to do it you want me to take off the other card is that it the the ace of fire the ace of wands and that's what's coming in that's like the result fire flowers okay like this is beautiful like if you don't get flowers today i don't know flowers fire a new feeling a new energy ancestor inheritance and it's like look i'm gonna show you this spread here when i'm hopefully i remember to show it to you it's really beautiful i did i mention that this is a new spread i literally designed all right so we have three aces here so today love money and like new life like life because the club's energy is like fertility the continuation of life sexual energy lust even self-expression Connecting to your roots, your ancestors. Yo. This person may want to plant a seed in you. There's something about flowers and roots and plants here. This person may want to put the fire in your belly. Like, I'm seeing if a female is giving a masculine flowers. She's really, she really, really, really likes you. You know what I mean? Like, on a real level up kind of vibration like she's committed she'll be committed to you she adores you she admires you she'll kiss you she'll support you so it's like if you're male you could be getting the attention from someone that's in a queen of cups vibration like this person would like nurture you love you make you feel good and a lot of love not that you would need it because they're your own source of love maybe that's what she loves about you like she would love your Your light. But someone is moving around to someone today. Alright, let's continue. Because we were at a crossroads earlier. So let's see how you feel now that you know the three of pentacles. For me, this is sun energy in card, playing cards. Success, prosperity, abundance. I'm getting a nostalgic feeling when I was younger and times were different. You know, times are different. And the sun was shining up on there. I was younger. I was walking on an unpaved road. It's a sense that I had maybe of contentment. I don't know why that day felt so beautiful to me. Maybe today. You know what I mean? No, maybe you don't. Like something new and amazing coming through. Passion, love, money. 
or a new life. The three is the three of pentacles is also work expressing your gifts using your gifts and what has come as a result of you and your gifts colliding or combining so it could be money like i say coming in for you manifested money remember the first card we pulled was the ace of pentacles and so no you are the receiver the manifester of what was originated the three so maybe you're going to also receive some money today or you will yeah in your home energy we have the four in the home energy we have the four of hearts when i say four of hearts that's home, home energy home energy like home on top of home because the four is the fourth house which is cancer which is home the heart is the fourth chakra which is home you know what i mean it's home home it's love it's a place of space peace it's also for me twin flame vibration when two of hearts come together that's so powerful our two two of hearts come together so you can imagine a person that's really aligned with their own sense of love and another person and their two souls meet maybe you're gonna be spending some time what are you doing? Counting money or working today? You could be spending time alone. At home. Today is Sunday. Okay, Sunday. Today is Sunday. Oh my God. This is your fear of being left sad or disappointed. The nine of pence, the nine of swords. The nine of swords is also a card of stability, strength that you have created because of your own will and determination to get through something or to stand up for something. And it may mean consequences. Like you may decide to put in some additional work, but it may mean you have to stay up late to work. Or you may have to break up with someone, but it may mean you have to cry a little bit. So it's like stability. And even going through the process of crying, it's strengthening you for what is next. Because I feel like you're about to stop crying now. You know what I mean? The Jack of Swords. somebody that's been watching you telling telling you of the seven of swords that roadblock okay so let's look at this So someone wants to come back around to you to start a family with you maybe to live with you just to be in home with you once again maybe to be in your arms they love you and they do feel like they you are the love of their life they want to be with you all right it may be someone from your past and it could be someone very very brand new that wants something new with you but anyway if it is your old person they feel like they want something new with you they just want to be in your warm embrace they want to love you and they want your love if it is someone new it's the same feelings but this person has never really experienced it with you but it's like they just have a feeling when they see you like yeah you're their swing their swing <laughs> your swing wow it's like your twin flame their soulmate vibration that's how they feel about you when this person sees you it could be that your past person is maybe road blocking this this new person from coming through that is very very interested in connecting with you it feels like they are right there as if they found it finally found you where you are you know what i mean but it's like you're you're next door you're right next door now or is the energy of finding someone and knowing they're just right across the road in a building and this one is in the, in the other building. 
yo, there could be two people that are interested in you at the same time, maybe today. You know, one of the, and, and I feel like if it's not both of them, both of them could be disappointed. For true, both of them could be. You know, both of them could be disappointed in heart. They could be left sad. You know, what I'm telling you, there's a time for you that's changing today. Something is shifting. If it is not in your life, it is just, it is mainly energetically a shift. Today, something brand new. I don't know if there's a roadblock or if a road is going to be fixed or some road work or you're going to go out on the road today and you're going to meet someone new. But something is happening. And it has to do with, I can't, it's not lost. Or it's not just the love. It's an intrigue. Because maybe someone has been watching you. Following you. Planning. Alright, so these are your messages for today. I think. So someone, someone, someone may be returning and someone, you may be getting bad news. That's a page of wands. That's a page of swords energy. Um, someone may be watching you. Like I say, we see the six of hearts. So I feel like someone may be returning. It's, it's, but I don't know. Something is amazing that is happening. Remember, like I say, you're going to get through some tough times with the nine of swords. I feel like that's the jack of swords is you arriving through that tough time to see, to stand and see something, to stand and see maybe the truth, who was who, what is what. Something is going to become so evident and so clear with the sun card out here too today. Okay, so you're going to get some news. Hey, Anna. All right, so this is what I have for you. I hope you found some that resonates with you and is able to help you along your journey. If you did, hit the like button, share, comment, subscribe. Much love to you on your journey. Remember that you are all and all is within you. Take care. Bye. Thank you.